all gonna die. <laughs> Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to Supercars of London and you would have seen on Friday that I massively cocked up the Top Gear substitution video. The mini movie from Monaco last weekend and our hunt to try and find Lewis Hamilton's Zonda 760 LH went live uh, at Friday at 8 o'clock instead of Sunday at 8 o'clock. However, that means you're getting an extra video this week and for this Top Gear Substitution episode we're going to have a lot of fun with a special guest, superstar YouTuber and we're currently en route now. We were supposed to be having an exciting time trial around the M25 but as you can see with the M25 on a Saturday it stands still. It said that we were going to be about 1 hour and 24 minutes away. We left at 59 minutes past 11 so we are now 17 minutes into our sort of time trial. No breaking the speed limit, no racing, just trying to beat the Google Maps sat nav based on our route. And uh, yeah, I'm doing zero miles an hour. As quickly as we get moving, we're back stuck in pretty bad traffic. It's telling us that it's 40 miles an hour, but that is not gonna happen. But Google Maps is telling me that we're only 35 minutes away from our destination. So we're not doing too bad. I think we are going to be arriving at around the one hour and 25 minute mark, which is exactly what Google Maps said, which is why I trust it so much everywhere that we go. Let's summarize the time trial challenge that I got set by my special guest. It is now 1.23 and my Google Maps said I was going to be one hour and 24 minutes and I left at 11.59. So we are supposed to have arrived right now on the dot. Google Maps is telling us that we are seven minutes away and I'm really excited. I'm really excited about um, coming up. I'm going to go arrive with the valves on because this video is V8 assemble. That was, uh, I haven't even thought about what I'm titling the video but it's going to be V8 assemble now. So I'm here with Eduardo Ciccone Jolie and we're really excited to find out what your favourite car is. Take two. What is your favourite car? <laughs> I like cars. The interview with Eduardo went very well and now he's decided that this is his new favourite car. We've got dual driving going on in here. What do you think of the car? Ah, uh, sign of a true petrol head. He needs his sunglasses to drive. We're going to see whether Eduardo likes the Army Tricks exhaust system. So we're going to start her up. Let her rip. I got some money. Are you going to buy this car with the money? Yeah. Mummy's saying no. So now we've done the, um, the baby's car collection. Baby cars. We're now going to go and check out Jonathan's Maserati. And we're also, I'm going to take him for a ride in my car so that he can... See how slow it is. <laughs> Let's go. Um, I can confirm <laughs> that Paul's car moves quickly. <laughs> it makes a lot of noise. And I may have peed my pants a little bit. <laughs> oh my god, that is insane. It's good, isn't it? <laughs> I apologize, neighbors. Bring it down. Whilst we cruise through the high street. We are cruising through the high street. It's a very important uh, process. You know, you, you gotta see. You know, this is just a question. Do the public appreciate this harmonica that you're driving around? Uh, yep, I'm not going to look at her. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Whenever I'm driving through busy parts, I always like try and stay off the accelerator. But because yeah. we're doing a video for YouTube, then it's slightly different. You gotta, you gotta respect that. Yeah. You know, I just hope this light goes green soon. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Bonjour! This is friends from uni. We're doing a YouTube video. Do you want to get in a YouTube video? Yeah. These are friends from uni. 
Hey y'all! <laughs> and there's some. Oh, it's gone green. Do you want to hold it? See you later! <laughs> So we've all seen what my car sounds like, or we've all heard what my car sounds like. So now it's time to jump in your car. I feel like that's not going to be good enough. But it's a V8 with a cross pipe exhaust system. I just, you know, this is a nuts. <laughs> I am excited about going in the Maserati. That's so random as well that we bumped into them. Yeah, that yeah, yeah. so random. Everybody heard you, and they're like, what the hell is that in the place around here? Like, <laughs> Yeah. Well, they're like, going in the vlog whether they like it or not. I never put, like, friends or, like, my girlfriend yeah. in the vlog, but they're going in the vlog, yeah. regardless. Not the vlog. This is the Top Gear substitution. This is better than the vlog. It's better than the <laughs> So if you're Jeremy, who am I? Whoever you want to be. Do you want to be Richard or do you want to be James? Uh, I oh, know you're the you're the star in the oh, recently yeah, yeah, yeah. priced car. <laughs> there is a police station up here. On your right. Yeah, because yeah, I come up this road sometimes. Uh, it's, it's a little bit up, it's a little bit up. Just don't go too nuts. We can get these girls a little bit. Here, right? <laughs> <laughs> Endless fun you can have yeah. with a loud car. Yeah. Lost 20 miles of fuel doing that. No way. Yeah. Oh, there's a police station. Sometimes I can down and I'm like, oh, sorry, shit. Two hands on the steering wheel. Yeah, ten to two. Mm. Jolly good. <laughs> now it's time to jump into the other V8. The gentleman's car. The gentleman's car. <laughs> that, was, that was the hooligan's car. <laughs> oh, look at the red. Matches the brake calipers. Matches everything. So this has got a cross pipe, the same style system yeah, as mine. Yeah, yeah, but much more. Oh, it's got a nice tone. Gentle. Gen All right, we give it a minute to... To warm up. Yeah. What you don't want to do when owning a Maserati Grand Sport is drink coffee. Because there is nowhere to put it. <laughs> Whenever you're going on long drives, you're yeah, like, no, yeah. I, will, I will hold it, <laughs> and that's it. You're like, I hope I don't need my other hand. <laughs> Luckily, there is no gear stick. Yeah. So you don't actually have to like change hands, but that's the one thing about it. like. That really is annoying. There's nowhere. There's actually nothing. Like, if you want to put your camera in your phone. <laughs> That's usually where it goes. And look it's at a that. family car. It's a family sports Two car. Two children in the back, off to school. You want to get to the nursery in six seconds? Boom. <laughs> Easing the Maserati in. Gentle. Gentle. You know. The Italian way. The Italian way. You don't want to slip your foot. <laughs> It's seriously quick. I wasn't expecting it to be that quick. This is I think the, you talked it down. Yeah. This is the revenge segment of the show. <laughs> where I make Paul pee his pants. <laughs> this is uh, this is the only tunnel that's near me. That's it. It's over. <laughs> it's got a real um the grumble to the yeah, V8. Yeah, is, yeah, yeah. Yours is a lot more high like Wah! Yeah, yeah. Yours is a bit a lot more <laughs> Yeah. When it gets warmed up, though, she's a... She's a screamer? Yeah, yeah, <laughs> you get her opened up. It's yeah. got a really nice tone yeah. to it. Yeah. I don't know if you get a sense from a... Uh, I don't know if it comes across on video, what it actually sounds like, but it's quite nice. Yeah. Because it's subtle, but then... <laughs> at the same time... Yeah, it, it, it's brutal, and it's instant power as well. Like yeah. it's, it's actually because you're not waiting on a turbo. There's no lag. There's no nothing. Naturally it's aspirated good. power. Yeah. So this is the first time that you've appeared on an automotive channel, and I'm grateful that it's Supercars of London. I've been offered many times. But I've turned them all down. <laughs> I said, no, I'm keeping my exclusivity for Paul. That is what we like to hear. So for those that don't know, would you like to explain what you do on YouTube? I film my life. You're Every a daily day. vlogger. A daily vlogger. A daily lifestyle vlogger. And it's um, it's insane. I mean, how many subscribers have you got? Yeah, over a million people. That's insane. And those numbers, it's like, ridiculous. do they just sort of like get lost in your head when oh, you think about it? Oh, it does, it? it does. You know, I think once you, once like, for the first like couple of thousand, you're like, that's incredible, you know? Then when we're talking millions, 
like that's just every mind it's like something like 20 something million views <laughs> and you're just like you get lost in those numbers and all you do is you you just see the camera as one person and exactly you're just, yeah. you're just talking to one person you forget that there's like all these people watching and you're just like it's just me and my friend and that's why i just always refer to him as friends so i'm like it's just me and my friend just exactly. like chilling that is a really cool outlook actually yeah. that yeah. is really they're just cool. like a third person point of view of my family also this is um this is its last drive so this is almost like an introduction to jonathan Sacconi jolie's car but at the same time it's a farewell video to the grand spot because he is buying a new car a new car and we're going to keep it take the boxer <laughs> Yeah. The fun we have in the leafy Surrey suburbs. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, you're getting a new car. We're going to leave it at that, and hopefully, well, you're going to be launch. You're going to be launching the car, I assume, on your channel before. Yeah. I will, but we'll, we, we'll come back. Yeah, we've got we've got some cool stuff planned uh, this week. Yeah, it's it's a, it's a more sensible car. A know? more sensible car. Yeah. You oh, know, we get really? you get old. You got the kids and all. You're like. You're playing. You're playing the next car down as well. <laughs> This is cool though, this is like a sort of a, yeah, farewell, I just felt like I was waving at the police there. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, this is the farewell video to the Grand Sport, this is the first time and the last time that you're probably going to see this on the Supercars of London YouTube channel, but not the last time that you're going to be seeing Jonathan behind the wheel. <laughs> <laughs> It is good, and now we're going to be driving safely back home. Turn off the sport button. Turn off the sport button. Yeah, come on now, down with that sort of thing. Cruise back home, because Maseratis, they're like the luxurious, classy GT cars, so yeah. I assume this is a really good motorway driver as well. Oh yeah, it's so easy to drive as well. It's so relaxing, like, you know, the seats, everything. Yeah. You know? That's why the new car as well is even another level of like, I feel like it's the balance of luxury and sport yeah you know because you want the sport for fun but then you also want to turn that off sit there with the wife and kids and just like cruise and chat just cruise along and just be like whatever so i'm going to start a poll on my youtube comment below on what you think jonathan's new car is going to be yeah yeah it's, and yeah. it'll be interesting to see the comments yeah because we've leaked some information that it's the perfect balance between sport and luxury it's going to be a GT car. It's got to fit the kids in the back. Yeah, two, 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 two plus two. Two plus two. Go.